Okay, so it's in the world of this whole Fallon, Porsche and Simon stuff, it seems that things have gotten way worse as Simon has dropped some major receipts. Hey guys, it's Murad Morali. Hope you guys are doing well today. Back at it again with another video. If you have not subscribed, guys, click that button for daily and consistent content. Daily and consistent, daily and consistent, daily and consistent, even at 1.18 in the morning. Now, let's get into this. So we have, you know, the fact that Simon has, and you know, Fallon, we want to, this, first and foremost, to me, this is just given staged. I don't know what it is. This is all just given staged to me. I don't think this is all real because the amount of things that are being developed. Is this an inside job for ratings? I don't know. Damn, my PCR test came back so quickly. That's insane. Yeah, I'm negative. Anyways, this is what he has posted. Again, major, like, I'm just genuinely shocked. And I just, yeah. I don't know, it's just, it's just, it's just giving me staged. I don't know, man, it's giving me staged, guys. When I say I have receipts of a cheating wife, this is what it looks like when Jaden Duckworth, AKA Jaden Banks, comes to my home sleeping with my wife whilst I'm out of town in Miami. Wait for the video showing them coming back to my home at the end of a night out trying to avoid front door cameras. The dumb Fs forgot the security cameras cover 360 degree views of the property. You cannot come on the property without being noticed by security cameras. There are more receipts if needed. Okay, Simona. Patricia who? Simona is here. Listen, these like, you can see them both coming in quite secretly. Um, and then there's more pictures of this particular individual waiting in a car on the premises. This was in February, I believe, when the divorce was taking place or the, or the proceedings took place. But at the same time, to be doing this on the property is very sus. And he says, tell me how many husbands or wives should tolerate this type of behavior from their spouse. So it's very interesting because she's not coming out with an entire documentary or interview, whatever. She gets very emotional. So what is the truth? Is all this just some fake crap that they're all concocting together to bring in ratings for the new season because the storylines are very, very dry. I actually don't know and I find it to be very confusing because none of this really makes any sense. But those receipts are insane and he really had the cheek to say more receipts if necessary. I really do hope Simon, you know, comes forth onto the show because since Patricia has left, we don't actually have anybody else who brings it. And I feel like the house husbands are very crucial, especially to shows like New Jersey and Atlanta. And we've lost that from Atlanta now because, you know, we just don't really see a lot of people. And I feel like Simona could definitely do what he needs to do for the show. Make of this information what you will, guys. Apparently, Sheree is coming back next season and it's been confirmed. But also, she's been parting it up a lot with Phaedra. And apparently, she's trying to, you know, persuade Phaedra to make some return in any capacity. I am ready for that. I feel like Phaedra needs to return. I want to see that Phaedra Candy sit down. Maybe she can come back as a friend of the show, test the waters. I do feel like a lot of the um, housewives now would film with her. We have Sheree, obviously. We have... Um, Portia, obviously, Kenya and Phaedra are on, you know, like cordial terms. So I'm sure that she would do a scene or two, whatever. And then the other girls don't know Phaedra to not do scenes with her. It's just Candy at this point. So I do feel like enough housewives are there to do scenes with her. I don't know what they could pull for the next couple of seasons, to be honest with you. I understand that, you know, people don't want to see the old people come back and etc. etc. But Latoya and Drew, the newbies, they weren't just giving it to they weren't they weren't giving to me what I wanted. I forgot Cynthia. Cynthia and Phaedra have met many times and I also, you know, would do scenes together. But I just don't see that the new girls didn't give to me what I wanted. They weren't giving what was meant to give. They, they just simply weren't. They weren't giving the kind of new fresh energy that Kenya and Portia both gave when they both arrived onto the scene. They just didn't for me. When I look back at it, they, they, they just didn't. So, and the season within itself was very dry. It was bolo this and bolo that for the entire season. Very dead. Um, but still the most watched housewives on the show. But anyways, make up what you will when it comes to this Simon stuff. Major receipts dropped. Let me know what your thoughts are. Subscribe to the channel, guys. Click that button, and I'll catch you guys soon for another video.